Hello, my name is Alex Rudzaviv and I'm here to help you get started with Cavli C10QM and C20QM EVK. Let's get to it. As you can see here, we have all the contents of the uh, DDK C10QM, C20QM EVK uh, kit laid out in front of us. Um, one thing to note is that the EVK for C20QM and C10QM, they will be the same. Uh, right now, I have a C20QM mounted on the EVK. Uh, going into the interfaces, the pin headers give you access to uh, all, uh, all the interfaces like uh, UART, uh, all the three UARTs uh, that are available, the SPI, the I2C. Um, you can see the RJ45 Ethernet jack, uh, Ethernet port, uh, the uh, slot for uh, SIM insertion, external SIM, the JTAG pin header. On top, you can find the um, on-chip uh, LT antenna and the diversity antenna and a provision for a UFL connection to an external GNSS antenna. On the left side, you can see the STC interface, the SD card slot, uh, the MIPI DBI interface, which connects to the uh, LCD display, um, the power uh, switch, the type C for five volt uh, input of, for the entire EVK, and a lot of uh, LEDs um, a stat uh, which indicate uh, various factors such as the W1 state, the LT connection state, the um, power uh, 3V3 voltages, etc. Moving on to the other um, addition to the eval kit, which is the add-on board, which uh, can which can be uh, bought along with the EVK, uh, which uh, helps you um, access the CAN interface um, via the SPI. Uh, the uh, it comes inbuilt with uh, accelerometer, uh, gyro, uh, temperature, uh, gyrometer, etc., and switches to control uh, several aspects of the display and other GPIO connections. You can find the LCD with it. It's a um, RGB display, uh, but but based off of MIPI DBI, uh, the micro USB cable and the Type C cable. Now we'll move on to the connections uh, that are required to get your eval kit st uh, started. So uh, we'll move the Aaron board and focus on the LCD display. And we'll connect the DS DBI interface to the DBI interface of the module. We'll have to push the uh, lock mechanism outward. Ensure that the uh, gold plates go into the socket properly in this orientation. I've uh, placed it in and I have to lock it by pushing it outwards and each tip has to come in now it's uh, put in place pin headers has to go into the pin headers here in the correct orientation Um, booting up the device um, by connecting the Type-C input. So um, my power source um, is my PC currently. You can use any external 5 volt um, power source. And as you can see, the uh, LCD has also initiated a boot showing the, uh, with the Cavli logo. And once the boot is completed, it, you will be welcomed with a simple cluster UI. So that is how you uh, connect and get started with the C10, C20QM EV kit.